Hello guys, so today uh, I'm going to be making a review on this outlet tester and if you uh, saw my last video, I actually reviewed this LED light that I have, but for this video, you're going to be seeing this outlet tester and also me testing what these lights do. So if we go ahead and look here, two amber lights, two amber lights mean that it is uh, correctly wired. I'm actually going to be doing the hot neutral reversed for this demo, which is these two lights, a red light and a amber light. It might not look like that in the video, because I'm sorry that this red light does not show up that well. It does not look that good in real life either. So, I'm actually going to go ahead and uh, take this outlet right here that I have. If we go ahead and put it into the video. This outlet right here, I actually wired myself. So, if we go and zoom out just a little bit. I actually wired this outlet myself. Like, it has a extension cord. Also, it has a plug right here. It has a plug, so it's really nice. So what I'm going to do is wire it and plug it in. And uh, this sh um, should say correct wire. So um, I'm going to go ahead and do that. So first let me unplug the light because the light... But actually, no, I don't have to unplug it. Unplug that. And then next I'm going to go ahead and plug in the outlet. Alright, so you see, alright, I just tried to see if it wasn't going to spark. Okay, well you see that there's two amber lights. That indicates on here, as you see there's a, in the logical box, but what that indicates is that correct wired. You can see it good, but uh, so it does come out good on this camera, but for some reason on my other camera, it will not come out that great. So now what I'm going to do is wire this outlet incorrectly so you can see the hot neutral reverse. I'm not going to be doing any type of open thing. So see you later or stay tuned. Alright, so here's the problem I wired in. So, as you can see, that the red light is on. You can see it better here. But the red light is on and the amber light is on. And the amber light in the middle is actually on. If you look at the back, there's no spark. Thankfully. Now, if we look on the diagram, match it up. It says hot. It's Now it's saying hot, neutral, reversed. So, this is kind of a neat... Um, thing to have in a household like if you want something to touch your devices this would be something great to have and also I'm actually going to be demonstrating this uh, thing working on the GSCI so we're going to go ahead and and by the way um, I'm going to go ahead and give a little description um, alright so please subscribe the video and also uh, subscribe to these um, channels below because these are the peop people that actually got me to this channel right here like to be right here standing behind the camera on YouTube uh, SER safety exit sign 250 and also, uh, let's see, uh, ask this old house. They, they helped me, um, get this channel. Like, I've been interested in fire alarms, exit signs, since I watched those people. And also, since, uh, They've, um, SCR Safety has been doing a uh, electrical video with the uh, GSCI testing. That also got me to watch uh, As It's Old House, which 
taught me in a bunch of things like circuit breakers and things like that. So those are really nice um, channels. Again, please go subscribe to them and please leave a like down in the into the comments and stay tuned for that GCI testing. I'm gonna go ahead. Alright, so now we're in my bathroom, and this GFCI, well, this is a GFCI, so this will actually test it. So if we go ahead and push it, it turns off. So, it's a really nice product. Also, if you push it in just a little bit, it's actually going to give you an open neutral reading. Like, you see one amber light right there? This is the only one lit, and if you go on to here, right there, open neutral, one amber light. So you gotta push it in all the way. So if you're gonna do that, you gotta hear the click to do it. I thought this GSTI was broken because I did that, but actually you gotta push it in all the way. You gotta wait until you hear the click, because that means the neutral is not making contact with the outlet. So, yeah.